I honestly don't remember my life without cancer. He was diagnosed when we were really young, and we spent birthdays, holidays, we spent a lot of our time at the hospital. We made the best of it, but it's hard because kids are supposed to just be able to have this life and it just to be able to explore, but it's hard to explore when you're hooked up to an IV pole and getting chemotherapy. Golden September is my childhood cancer awareness project that unites all children battling cancer and unites all hospitals, organizations, and people like me who want to help make a difference. When my parents told me that my brother Jack was not going to make it, I asked them what the color and month for childhood cancer was, and they said that it was gold and that the month was September. We want to be able to get gold in September as popular as pink in October one day. Because of my brother's illness, we had to travel all over the country. We went to Texas, Michigan, New York. When you, you travel all those places, it kind of brings the reality of how much damage this disease does because you see people from all over the world, all over the country, coming to all these different places looking for hope. More than a classroom of kids is diagnosed with cancer every day. Only 80% of those kids will survive five years with cancer. You can't win the fight against this awful disease with just the people who are trying to fight it. That's like trying to win a war with only the wounded. And so we need all of the people, all of the soldiers that are healthy and able to help fight. A lot of kids don't realize that they have potential to help make a difference in the world. In the here. Take a pick. Aaron Rodgers? Yes, you yes. know it, buddy. <laughs> We've got a lot of schools to do things, penny wars, bake sales, lemonade stands, fun runs. My field hockey team got shirts made that have the Golden September logo on them, and they wear them to tournaments around the country. By wearing a gold shirt, it can make a difference for the fight against cancer because when you're fighting cancer or have a family member fighting cancer, just knowing that other people know about it and are willing to support it is huge because it shows that you're not in this alone. I want to be remembered as the girl who made a difference. I want to be remembered as someone who made an impact in childhood cancer. He was always optimistic, always looking on the bright side. And even when Jack was going through all this harsh treatment, he somehow found a way to put a smile on other people's faces. The fact that he could be so happy and so alive, even with all of this damage, it just made me realize that we have to do something for those kids who aren't that optimistic or can't look on the bright side. Jack wanted to help make a difference too, and he had no idea what an impact he would have on all of us.